Hello! Today I've come down to the beach to collect some pebbles to make my very own glow-in-the-dark snake. Always remember to come to the beach with an adult, watch for the tides coming in and wear sun cream. OK, hop along with me and let's go see! <laughs> <laughs> this looks like a great place to find lots of smooth pebbles, exactly what I need to make my snake. <laughs> what a perfect pebble! Ooh, this small one will make a nice tail for my snake. I've collected lots of nice pebbles. Time to head back and start making my glow-in-the-dark snake. Right, the first thing I've done is given my pebbles a quick wash and laid them out into a snaky shape. There's only two other things you'll need. One is a paintbrush like this. Oh, uh, not quite as big. <clears throat> ah, that's much better. And the other is some glow-in-the-dark paint like this. Right, now that you've got everything ready, you can paint your snake. Can you see how I've put the big pebble at the top for his head and the smaller pebbles for the tail? I'm just adding some nice snaky patterns to my pebbles. Snaky, 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 snaky. <laughs> Make sure you put plenty of paint on. Just a little bit more. I'm finished! Now all I have to do is wait until dark. <laughs> it could be some time. Maybe I'll do some sunbathing. <laughs> I've put my snake in a room with the lights on, wait a few minutes and then turn them off. Oh, I seem to have got some paint on my nose. Right, better find a light switch. <coughs> Oops, not that way. Ouch! I'll see you soon. 